Over the Edge is a fundraising event, um, and we work with nonprofit partners to make it a successful fundraiser. Our fundraising event is obviously repelling off of buildings um, or you know local structures. So that's what the event is. For this event in State College, we partnered with Interfaith Human Services and Faith Center, um, and they collectively have raised over eighty-four thousand uh, by each participant raising a thousand dollars to go over or more to go over the edge. I'm here today because I'm a member of the board of directors of the one of the sponsoring agencies, which is Interfaith Human Services from State College. Our church, St. Paul's United Methodist, is a member uh, congregation of that organization. And that group, in summary, basically is neighbors helping neighbors. We're, we're assisting people with a variety of human service needs. And that's something that really speaks to me, and that's why I'm participating today. And I've been able to raise about thirteen hundred dollars. Take care. George actually made over the edge history today because he's our oldest propeller that has ever gone over the edge. So ninety-eight years old. I think we were at ninety-two or something before. So um, he did a great job. I was on the roof. We did a Facebook live, and uh, yeah, it was awesome to see him do so well. We belong to um, St. Paul's United Methodist Church. Our associate pastor, Becky McGee, went over the edge earlier this morning, so we were here for that and we were staying because we know some other edgers. Penn State students, of course, are our guests in town, but at the same time I think they're probably aware of the fact that uh, there are many people of different income levels that, could, that will need human services and, and they should be interested as well in, in the fact that the community is helping those individuals.